and welcome to Monkey News. Over to our live presenter Bernard Beringi for the latest news bulletins. Thanks, Joe. More than half of Poles oppose the location of part of a U.S. anti-missile shield on Polish soil, a poll showed on Tuesday, a day after the Polish president said the project was a foregone conclusion. Pollster CBOS said 55% of those surveyed opposed the anti-missile shield plans, while 28% had no objections. Dissident U.S. intelligence officers angry at former Defense Secretary Donald Rumsfeld helped a European probe uncover details of secret CIA prisons in Europe, the top investigator said on Tuesday Swiss Senator Dick Marty, author of a Council of Europe report. On the jails, said senior CIA officials disapproved of Rumsfeld's methods in hunting down terrorist suspects, and had agreed to talk to him on condition of anonymity. A game of cat and mouse is underway between the U.S. government and Florida's Ernest Hemingway Home and Museum over the fate of dozens of felines roaming the former home of the Nobel Prize winning author of The Claws Are Out over whether the 47 cats that live on the grounds where Hemingway wrote to have and have not should be caged or even allowed to remain on the lush subtropical property. One of the Florida Keys major tourist attractions. And now back to Joe at the Monkey News Studio. That's all from the main news. And now finally for a little light relief, we go over to our resident local live presenter. Hi Joe. A German bus driver threatened to throw a 20-year-old sales clerk off his bus in the southern town of Lindau because he said she was too sexy and he couldn't concentrate on his driving, Bild newspaper reported on Monday. The driver shouted at the woman, saying her cleavage was distracting him every time he looked in his mirror and told her to sit somewhere else. The woman said she moved to another seat but was humiliated by the bus driver, but his company has defended his actions. And back Joe at the studio. That's all from me, here at Monkey News.